A gaming mouse is one of the most critical components of a PC gaming setup. A quality mouse designed specifically for gaming will deliver the speed, accuracy, and features you need to win. Whether you're immersing yourself in massive single-player adventures or competing in multiplayer for glory and fame, a cheap productivity peripheral is simply not going to cut it. Besides having gaming-grade sensors that give it a higher DPI, as well as making it more accurate and responsive than regular mice, it also boasts some features useful for gaming. Those include programmable buttons, fast response times, and weight adjustments, as well as excellent ergonomics to save your wrists and shoulders from unnecessary chronic pain. Are you looking for a new gaming mouse but don't know which one to choose because of the different options that are available? In this video, we will break down the top 5 best gaming mice on the market this year. We've spent many hours researching dozens of products, and I've listed all of my top gaming mice recommendations, covering everything from entry-level gaming mice that are great for those on a budget, to the very best of the best. So if you're interested in finding out which gaming mouse will be best for you, stay tuned. To see the most up-to-date prices and find out more information about these products, you can check out the links in the description below. The products mentioned in this video are in no particular order, so make sure you'll stay tuned till the end so you don't miss anything. We'll start with the Razer Death Adder V2. The Razer Death Adder V2 improves on everything we love about the Death Adder Elite. It has an all-around fantastic shape for all sorts of grips and hand sizes, and I've spent hundreds of hours playing games, using Photoshop, and browsing the internet with it. Despite years of iterations, Razer never messes with the Death Adder's shape. There's no reason to. The Death Adder V2 uses a 20,000 DPI Razer Focus Plus optical sensor, and while big numbers don't necessarily equate to quality, here they do. Razer's newest tech delivers flawless tracking even if you move the mouse as fast as humanly possible. For the majority of games and gamers, the Death Adder V2 is a fantastic mouse. Its design is simple, with two perfectly placed, generously sized thumb buttons. It also has an excellent optical sensor that will work on both hard and cloth pads, and it has the ultimate body shape for a claw or hybrid claw palm grip. If you want the absolute best version of Razer's most reliable wired mouse, this is it. Next, we'll be taking a look at the SteelSeries Rival 600. There are a few things you need from a gaming mouse. Accuracy, consistency, and comfort. The SteelSeries Rival 600 offers each in abundance. The SteelSeries Rival 600 delivers an incredibly accurate sensor in the form of the TrueMove 3 sensor, which can not only keep track of your movements along the mouse pad, but also detect the height of the mouse above the mouse pad, letting you tune the lift-off distance. The Rival 600 offers split triggers for consistency on the primary mouse buttons, and includes three thumb buttons you can map extra game controls onto. The grips on the side of the mouse help it keep easily in your hand, while the customizable weights let you change the weight and center of gravity to your liking. Add in the fully customizable RGB lighting system, and the SteelSeries Rival 600 is one of the most thoroughly modern gaming mice you should definitely check out. Although the mouse has excellent overall performance and is highly customizable with a large number of buttons, it's on the heavier side. Nevertheless, it has a very low latency and has exceptional ergonomics, so you can customize it to your liking. So, whether you lift or not, the SteelSeries Rival 600 is one of the best gaming mice for FPS shooters and pure accuracy. The next mouse in our list is the Glorious Model O. The Glorious Model O is an excellent ultralight gaming mouse that feels very well built and solid with a honeycomb pattern design that places it among the lightest mice we've tested. The Model O weighs in at just 68 grams thanks to its honeycomb design, yet this modern gaming mouse feels solidly built and comfortable in the hand. In our testing, the light heft of the Model O makes it notably easier to flick onto a target in shooters like Counter-Strike, even when compared to a svelte mouse like the 80-gram Logitech G Pro Wireless or the 91-gram SteelSeries Rival 110. It has a total of six buttons, including two on the side, and all of them are easily programmable within the companion software. The Model O's cable is also novel, with a super flexible paracord-like material used instead of the more usual rubber or braided cable. This makes the mouse almost feel wireless. There are surprisingly few sacrifices elsewhere too. With an industry-standard Pixar 3360 optical sensor, 
a soft notch scroll wheel, clicky Omron buttons, and RGB lighting. The software is also decent with full access to the settings you need and little else to distract you. It has a very comfortable ambidextrous design that's suitable for any grip style. However, its large body isn't well suited for people with smaller hands who may feel more comfortable using the glorious Model O Minus, a smaller version that performs similarly. Next is the Corsair Qatar Pro XT, our choice for the best value gaming mouse. The Corsair Qatar Pro XT is easily one of the best budget gaming mice on the market by matching comfortable design, great functionality, and competitive price. While it might not be as feature-rich as some other gaming mice, the Qatar Pro XT still manages to pack a lot into its featherweight build. At just 2.68 ounces, this is a lightweight mouse that's great for long gaming sessions and that you can quickly adjust to. It's a bit low profile, but has a nice, ambidextrous shaped shell that doesn't feel cheap, despite this being a budget mouse. With 18,000 DPI max, the Corsair Qatar Pro XT is precise enough for all but the most bloodthirsty ranked FPS matches where its standard 1000Hz polling rate will hold it back from taking on its more expensive counterparts. Targeting FPS and MOBA players, Corsair's mouse glides easily and without cable drag, thanks to PTFE feet and a paracord USB Type-A tether. Speaking of the tether, the wireless version of this mouse, the Corsair Qatar Pro Wireless, can be found for only slightly more if not on sale for the same price as this wired version. So that's worth considering. And if you're after the lightest mouse, something with a honeycomb shell like the glorious mice on this page save more weight. The Qatar Pro XT isn't the flashiest or the most unique mouse out there, but it will make a reliable gaming companion. Last, we'll be looking at the Logitech G502 Lightspeed. The Logitech G502 is a crowd favorite thanks to its ergonomic shape, infinite scroll wheel, and 11 programmable buttons. That makes the G502 Lightspeed, the recently released wireless version, an easy recommendation. The new G502 is every bit as reliable and responsive as its wired predecessor, thanks to Logitech's excellent Hero Optical Sensor and the eponymous Lightspeed Wireless Tech. And it even manages to be lighter than the original at 114 grams although you can add 16 grams with extra weights, if you prefer. This translates into a quick and comfortable mouse suited for both gaming and productivity. Battery life is good at 48 hours with lightning and 60 hours without. And you can get 2.5 hours of battery life in just 5 minutes of charging. If you love the comfortable shape and the excellent performance of the G502, the wireless version is definitely worth a try even if it is twice the price of the wired G502 Hero. It's hard to find much to dislike about the Logitech G502 Lightspeed, other than the price. The classic design is ergonomic and comfortable, the weight is adjustable, and of course, it's wireless. It has long battery life, and if you have a PowerPlay charging mat, you won't ever have to worry about plugging it in. Alright guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you liked the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to help you keep up to date with the best products on the market right now. So if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.